Good morning, afternoon, evening, guys, whatever time of the day it is, wherever you are in the world, and welcome to the new demo, or updated demo, of Resident Evil 7. And what I'm going to do today is show you how to get the dirty coin, okay? Yep, we're going to get the dirty coin, guys. This is the first thing you have to do, is pull this little lever there. And then go through this little secret place. Pick up the fuse. And back round. And then go and put the fuse in the fuse box. Right, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go up these stairs. And we're going to go and jump out of our skin because of that noise. <laughs> But then we're going to get the staircase down, is what we're going to do. Okay, so we're going to go up here. I'm going to take this first door here on the right. And then we're going to run past the phone and we're going to go in here. And what we're going to do is we're going to get the basement key. We're going to grab the handgun bullets. Then we're going to go over here. And we're going to grab the little celluloid hand. And then we're going to get the hell out. We're going to open this now. We're going to get the dummy finger. We're going to go in here. And we're going to go and get the uh, cutters. Here we go. Get the bolt cutters. And get the videotape. You don't, I don't think it really matters what particular order you do this in, guys. It's up to you. Okay, we're now going to head back down here. Also, another thing I'm going to do is put the dummy finger in the actual little hand. So we've now got that. I'll show you why in a moment because it'll be very important okay right here's where you go now guys you go into this bathroom now in here in this little cabinet little cabinet is handgun bullets so pick them up open this drawer there's more handgun bullets pick those up okay <clears throat> in here is neil from the young one's bath there's neil in there look hey there's my bike and here we have a missing thing. And here we have a toilet that don't flush, okay? We'll get to that in a moment. Right, now we go down here. Hang on a moment. First thing you do as well, pick this up, guys. This is the empty book. This is very, very important, this blank notebook. You can't do it without that. Um, I think these are both empty, if I remember correctly. I can't get nothing from them. And that's empty as well. Okay, then... We use the key. And go down these stairs. Now down here. There are handgun bullets. So pick those up. And the first thing I'm going to do. You don't have to do it this way guys. But it's just you know. But while I'm here. It is how I'm going to do it. Okay. Is I'm going to grab this. And then I'm going to get the fuck out. Now don't worry because you never. Don't worry. You never get caught by the monster. You can just run. Okay. So don't worry about it. You never get caught by him. So when he attack, Well he doesn't attack. When he comes... Just kick the door and you'll be fine. Right, we're going to go and whack the old valve in here. So we can get the gun. We're going to get a nice hand gun now, guys. Okay, so let's flush the toilet. And then we've got a gun. And if we reload... We now have seven bullets in it, okay? Right. Now, 
the next thing I'm going to do while I'm here, I just you don't have to do it this way, guys. You don't have to shoot him, okay, the monster. But I just like to because it's just easier for me, okay? It's just easier for me to, to shoot him, that's all. Okay, right, he comes from over here. Here he is. Right, let's go. Right, now don't worry, okay, if he gets you, because whether you're infected or not doesn't matter, all right? Now, he got me that time, the son of a bitch, but it doesn't really matter whether you're infected or not. You will still get the coin, and you will still get the, um, it will still transfer the data over, so don't worry about it. Right, now... And what I'm going to quickly do as well, guys, is get the... Um, there we go. We're going to get this. We'll get the axe first, okay? Right, break this box. There you go, and you get more handgun bullets. Right, now here's where we're going to go. First of all, is over here. Okay, now, once you get that first laugh, go and check your notebook. And you'll find it's now got something written on it, okay? So now, what we're going to do is we're going to head back down the stairs. Or in my case, limp. And we're going to go to where the clock is. You're going to get the dummy finger. And you're going to point it at that case. There, hang on. Right there. And as you can hear, the case crushed her. Okay, so that's the first part. Second part. We're going to go back up here. And we're going to go and look at the light. Up here. There's a light up here, right? Which triggers the second giggle. Okay, now go back into your notebook. And you now have another little riddle. Right, now what you got to do... Is you've got to go back... To the basement. This does remind me a bit of the sort of guardhouse in Resident Evil Remake. Which is kind of cool. Can't wait to play this game properly. Right, and then here... Is where feel is so get your finger out and point it at him there you go we've got to go back okay we're gonna come out of here we're gonna go in here right and now we're gonna go over to the stairs and we're going to get this painting here of this woman. And we're going to whack it with the axe. There you go. You now trigger off the next one. Okay, now if you look in the book. You've now got something else. Stanley, okay. Now, where Stanley was. Was under here. This is where Stanley was, right? So you got to go here. you got to get your finger out. And you got a point. It's there. There you go. So he was obviously locked in there and probably left to die. Okay, now what you got to do, guys, is go over to this mirror and then do a quick turn. Okay, once you do the quick turn, check your book. And we now have Marlene, okay? Proud of our white and blue necklace, blah, 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 blah. Now, what are you going to do again now? We're going to go up the stairs. Right. Now, remember the blue and white? There's the blue and white. See the wires up there that are blue and white? Right. Get your finger out again. And point them. There you go. 
and there you go so she was hung okay right now guys this is the part that sometimes is a bit difficult okay because there's no guarantee that it always works first time and i don't think anyone really knows how it's it's properly triggered but we're now going to go and play the old video tape the old vhs tape okay here we go <clears throat> we're going to play the tape okay guys after you do the videotape i'm going to go in here and pick up the key that's here the back door key i'm not going to use it but i'm going to pick it up anyway um okay right so i'm going to get that holy fucking shit that's <laughs> still scares the fucking shit out of me right, i'm just gonna like use the key i don't know if you have to do this guys again i'm not sure if you actually have to but okay i don't know if you have to actually use that or not but i do anyway okay right now we're gonna head back to the basement right and here is where you'll either be very lucky or unlucky because if you notice here on the floor is a doll just look at the doll and crouch down okay and nothing has happened okay guys right if nothing happens you are going to have to go and play the videotape again okay right let's try this again and see if we can trigger off the giggle Will it happen this time? <laughs> Yay! Success! Okay, right guys, once you finally get that giggle, check your notebook again. It does happen eventually, so there you go. And now it's Timmy. Did not mind the harsh light of four suns. Eyes require heads, and he did not have one. now we're gonna head up stairs and back to the kitchen we're then gonna head to this cooking pot here and we're gonna point at the cooking pot And that is it guys now we're gonna head upstairs then we're gonna go through here and then the door this door that was locked that you couldn't get in we can now actually open and you get this little secret room look at this so there's a little secret room and on a chair you have that rewarding little sign saying you're the best ever and if you look there is a dirty coin take the dirty coin <laughs> get one last little giggle and then make your escape or try to i got attacked so i'm not going to get the good ending i'm going to get the bad ending but it doesn't matter So there you go guys it then says this you can transfer this item to the main game if you have saved data for this demo and you just save it just press ok and that's it that's how you get the dirty coin okay guys just remember to persevere with a videotape if it doesn't work the first time or the second time or even the third fourth time you know just keep doing it it will eventually work you do have to have a bit of patience with that part i hope that's helped you out for anyone that didn't know how to do it then please feel free to like and subscribe okay guys in the meantime and in the meantime guys have a good day <laughs>